Good morning, cultists. Welcome back to another Unbalanced Breakfast with Cthulhu's. So, in our last episode, we managed to fend off the fourth crusade for Aquitaine. And now the Christians are just reeling. There appears to be a... What is this? What kind of revolt is this? A Croatian revolt that is now plaguing various parts of Lombardy and Croatia. Um, not exactly sure how that happened, but you know what? I'd say good for you, you dumb sacks of shit. That's what you get for attacking me, assholes. I mean, I could go for a holy war for this, um, place here, but, uh... Eh. Actually, what I want to do is I want to attack this guy for his... Are you... Do you have any vassals? What do you actually own? Oh, okay. Oh, that's actually... Okay, great. So I want to actually attack this guy for Savoy. Because that is technically a part of mine. Or not conquest. I actually gets the jure claim? No, I actually, actually do conquest. Because I think if I do conquest, then I gain a little bit of... Or no, it's... Maybe de jure claim would actually make it so that I don't get in as much threat. So let's do, do de jure claim. And actually, I want to take Portugal again. I don't know what th happened here. I honestly have no idea how this happened. It's a little bizarre to me. Um, maybe I can kill him? No. Can we abduct him? No, it doesn't seem to be possible either. So I'm thinking we do a holy war for Portugal. And then this guy will join in, being all pissy and shit. He's like, oh no, you're attacking Portugal. He's my friend. Well, you're a sack of shit. I have a Dejure claim on your land there too, buddy. Hmm. But if I attack him now... Actually, who here... Ah, shit. Will I have a truce on him as well? No, right? Because he's a... He's just an alliance member. Hmm. Let me think. Like, wait, let me think on this for a brief second here. I know you have a pact with... Well, you have... Oh, you're part of a defensive pact. Wait, is that it? You're actually just part of a defensive pact? I guess you are. Huh. Weird. Never really thought that was, um... That I had more defensive packs against me, but... That makes sense. Yeah, definitely next playthrough, I will be turning off defensive packs, because it is fucking garbage. Just artificially slowing shit down for nothing. I don't know, maybe some people like it. In that case, I apologize for calling it fucking garbage, but... To me, it is. So let's go for the Holy War for Portugal, restore our lands, make Hispania great again, or at least whole again. I don't know if it was ever great. It certainly, um, you know, it was certainly big and unruly at points, but great? Eh, not so much. Actually, what happened to my genius son? Ricardo, he's the quick one. I have too many children, I can't fucking possibly find out. Oh no! Kuchulain died of camp fever! My genius son is dead! My son is dead! So it's like a reverse Batman thing going on. Well, except it was camp fever that killed him, not some brutish thug who uh, uh, tried to mug us outside of a, an opera house or whatever. Or was it the theater? I don't know. I'll ask Batman next time I see him. Hey Batman, how'd your parents die? You son of a bitch! Swear to me! That you'll never ask me about my parents again. My chance are not do- oh, Dude, come on. Think I hire you for your good looks, you piece of shit? You know what? Here, that'll teach you. Little sack of shit not doing anything. Absolutely unacceptable. What is these guys taking? Aragorn... Or Aragon, Aragon, he's a viceroy, so that worked out, which means that I think I need to revoke this guy's title again, because I don't see it says viceroy on him, it says viceroy on him as well, and it says king on him, so that means mean that he's not in fact a viceroy, which is garbage. Thankfully, Andalusia has um, gotten a lot smaller. Wilfredo, well, come on, man, don't do this to me. That's right. 
Doesn't Granada at one point become a kingdom too? Or am I wrong? Is that EU4 that I'm thinking? I just told you about not being decadent. Oh, I guess, you know what? He did this before I had the talk. Eh, just go confess your sins or some shit. I don't know. And... Is this... Okay, that's that place. Great. You know what? We'll just see you down. I don't think we really need to worry about the, um... The differences in... Troop sizes here. Is he actually coming for me? He ain't left in a finger. Well, Portugal looks like you're on your own. Um, hate to say it, but, uh, your friend... Yeah, you've been left in the dust. There ain't nobody coming to help you now. 100%? Perfect. You piece of shit! That's right. Restoring our rightful rulers of, um... Our rightful Yazidi rulers. Back into Portugal. And look at this guy. Pelagio, he was just... Ready. He was... Getting ready to take over Porch Kale. Great. We're gonna get some of these guys um, created before we hand it off to you. Because they don't want you to be too powerful now, Lagio. And you can take Porto. Perfect. And don't worry, I'm also gonna give you the Duchy, just so you know. Well, uh. But it was meant to be a surprise, but you know what? Eh, it's okay. I can ruin the surprise for you. It doesn't really matter. We'll get you guys to stand down, and then we'll actually attack Sirt as well. Is uh, no, let's do a de jure claim on Sirt. I think that might hopefully reduce, not make our threat go up so much. Although it's already at 75 fucking percent, it's insane. It is absolute garbage, I swear. Um, it needs to be created? Are you kidding me? What happened to it? Where did it just suddenly go away? Or why did it suddenly go away? No, I'm not, not gonna include lower titles anymore. Because that seems to be creating a whole bunch of issues. Yeah, not anymore. Not anymore. More issues with Quranic Verses. These guys are like the most dissatisfied bunch of jerks ever. And by these guys, I mean my court. Not any specific group of people. Except my court. Freaking god, what the shit is this? What? What? What are you doing? These guys are converting to fra Fraticelli? What? Where are you in, in Nevers? Are you, are you converting all your people to Fraticelli? That is... <laughs> something else. I really need you to die, by the way. Um, can you get... Touched by, uh, touched in your taint. She's got chest pains, maybe she'll die of a heart attack. Did she just... Did she just heal yourself with Satan's power? Oh, man. Whoa, wait, what? How come she's the heir? Absolutely not. I'm gonna touch your taint too, miss. Shit. No, no, let's not. Let's avoid that. Excuse me. Sorry, I had to sneeze very violently there. Um, even though you hate me because you're my nemesis, you still want me to do shit for you. Okay, sure. Uh, you want this guy to fall into depravity. Cool. What exactly am I doing? Can you um, write down the instructions for me, please? You want me to corrupt him. Yeah, I can do that. You think someone would make a good chief? Could he? Absolutely not. Look at his learning. It's garbage. Look at his hairstyle. It's even worse than his fucking learning. No way I'm gonna give someone with that bad of a hairstyle, um... Any kind of, like... Official duty. Let's just look at all the, uh, people in power who have terrible hairstyles. Kim Jong-il, for example. He had, uh, the worst fucking hairstyle ever. And he was the dictator of North Korea. No more, but he was at one point, so, you know, the uh, point still stands. Uh, No person lives... Okay, right. No person lives a life entirely devoid of sin, and neither does Count Froila. I just have to find some traits of his character that I can build on. Hmm. Guilty pleasures into vices. No. Hmm. 
Yeah, let's try to turn his guilty pleasures into vices. Like his proud, that should be a thing. Thorough investigations have revealed Crank Froyla rather likes his gold. I wonder if he is a gambling man. I shouldn't write the invitation and coat my words with honey. Fantastic. Send him your old honey tongue. Losing a little bit of money. During our game as a chance, Count Froyla struggled more and more to hide his fondness for the gold coins on the table. With some well-placed words, I managed to make him come to terms with his greed. Letting Froyla win most of the games ensured he left both thankful and in high spirits. The things I do for Iblis. So how come I call him Iblis at some points and Satan at other points? What is this? What are you doing? Are you revoking shit from your counts, you asshole? And, oh, she has rabies. There is most likely, yep, there's... <laughs> couldn't even finish my sentence. Yeah, there's no coming back from that. So I'm the heir, again, thankfully. I can't really kill her though, can I? I can try to... Maybe? See if I can... Bribe some people? I lost the spy master. Oh, I inherited whatever. Great. I'll send you a gift as well. And is that the only two people that we can really bribe to be uh, part of the plot? That'll have to do, I suppose. Unfortunately, she has gone into hiding. Which is a real shame. Hmm. Mercy, cried the thief when Prince uh, uh, confronted and accused him of being the robber. I don't want to hang him. So, let's not. Um, I mean, I don't want to feed my, indulge my arbitrary trait. Thank you very much. Can usurp the kingdom of Aquitaine? Hmm. I could. Wouldn't be the worst thing in the world. But then, I mean, these guys would be like, Oh, I want the kingdom of Aquitaine because I'm a little bitch. Well, maybe I'll hold off on it for now. Inherit the Duchy of Tunis. Fair enough. I can give this right back to someone else. That's uh, fine. Actually, I'm kind of wondering if I should have um, usurped those kingdom titles in my last episode. Because uh, that means people are going to be unhappy that I'm ho holding on to it. Right? But maybe I shouldn't have. Oh well. It's fine. If I really need to, I'll just demolish it or whatever. Destroy the title. And you can be the Dutch Duke of Tunis. Great. Yeah, I am never doing that. Uh, whoa, whoa, whoa. What is this? What are you? The Spanian army? Are you? I inherited his retinue. Okay, so that's a thing. I had no idea. I really had no idea. Huh. Actually, the Knights Hospitaller, they are really fucking annoying. Can't vassalize them. Great. Can we recruit you for Satan? No, he doesn't have any sins. Uh, we could... No, we can't even try to kill you. That's fine. Just siege it all down, guys. Don't wait for me. Yeah, you don't want to wait for me. Oh shit, they're taking attrition penalty. Shit. Right, let's see if you guys can get there a little faster. Actually, you guys can stay there. Ah, shit. Okay, so I've inherited the kingdom of Aragon, which means that the Viceroyalty title, title there is working as intended. Which is great. Unfortunately, I don't know what's going on here. This is fucking garbage. Absolutely not. Whatever the hell you're doing over here is just the worst. No. Although I still want to kill that lady. I also want to take care of the this situation here. Where he's got way too much crap that doesn't belong to him. Hmm. Yeah. <sighs> Shit. He's got two of those. It's fine. We'll deal with that in a second. Right now, we are... In the middle of a war that we need to take care of here. Go up to Benghazi. People are trying to kill Wilfredo. I don't really give a rat's ass. Wilfredo can suck it. You guys can move over to Sunusi. 
Kingdom of Aragon. Yeah, that's fine. People are trying to kill my wife. That's a bit of a shame, but oh well. Not a big deal again. As long as they're not killing me, I'm I'm okay with it. I can use... Oh uh, no, Aquitaine, just go away. Aquitaine. What is this extra land that I'm holding that I shouldn't be? Oh, this one. Got it. Got it, got it, got it. Let's give that away. To whom, though? Let's not give it away to the guys who have no testicles. You have all your goods intact, so you can actually take that thing. Is that part of... that is part of Auvergne. Which means... ah, oh man, I kind of wasted that guy. Oh, well, that's okay. You can take... That guy, perfect. Good job. I mean, good job to me, I guess. Good job for you, maybe? I don't know. That's one... What is... What is... The... Benny Yanin Pet... Jeez, no. Let's abduct him. Absolutely not. I'm not gonna stand for traitors. Good. Satanists! Do your thing. You guys done your thing yet? Oh, people are... Uh, more people are embracing Yazidi religion. Perfect. Great. Now that you're in my prison, you have no choice but to make your time. Perfect. <laughs> that is, uh, I guess, a bit of an exploit, but you know what? That's okay. And uh, we'll deal with you, too. I, I don't know how you got your 8,000 troops over there. Um, but it's strange, I gotta say. But hopefully this should be a fairly easy fight for us, maybe? We'll see. Wait, how many troops did we lose there? Shit, I didn't read that. Crap. Ah, good old tunnel vision. Actually, you don't even need to attack them anymore. It's just enforced demands. Perfect. Get these guys to disband. And you guys can come home. Just pick an mission. Just build a war chest. And of course, more people are going to be like, Oh, here you go. I can give you my money because I'm, I'm a sycophant. Yeah, I'm going to revoke your title because... Um, I don't want to spend money and time trying to bribe you to see things my way and all that crap, so I'm just going to straight up revoke shit from you. Because you're an ass. Just so you know. In case you weren't aware, you are in fact an ass. Like the biggest of asses, of course. Yep. I like it how these guys sound like, oh yeah, sure, I'm, I'm giving it to you out of my own goodwill. No, you're not. You have no choice. Don't pretend like you're doing it out of the goodness of your heart, or out of some, like, civil or moral duty. No. You, you're you doing it because you don't want your ass blasted by me. And, uh, if there's anyone who is the best at ass blasting, it is, of course, yours truly, Emperor Bernardo. And you can take this new uh, vassal, by the way, of Cert. Great. Yeah, I guess I have, um, a skirmish army there. Or skirmish retinue. Eh, that's fine. There are worse things to inherit. Like syphilis, for example. I need a new successor. Which means I don't have any eligible children? Or what? I do have some eligible children. The Kingdom of Abyssinia. I could claim Abyssinia. Holy shit. Hmm. I could. But I don't know if I really want to. And you know what? I don't think my threat has gone up that much. Um, since I did the uh, du jour claim war. And I'm thinking that might have been a part of it. That maybe I don't get as much threat if I... Did you do a du jour claim war? This guy? He's part of some band or another? Uh, let's not. Great! Another Sunni revolt. We will abduct you. And then maybe... Well, we can't sacrifice you to Satan, because we need to get a peace tea, a treaty out of you. Absolutely not! What happened to my last Chief Kadi? You want me to do what? Oh, make this guy uh, corrupt him? Yeah, sure, I can do that. Who is my... What What happened to my last Chief Kadi? You just die? What an asshole. What an unbelievable asshole. I don't want the uh, arbitrary guy to be my Chief Kadi. Let's get this guy, he's actually really good. 
I don't know if it really matters one way or another, but eh, it's fine. We need to get a new court musician. This guy can be their court musician. And no. Let's turn his guilty pleasures into vices. Uh, yeah, just avoid that huge stack over there. I mean, I say huge, but it's not really. No, no, no. And I coat my words with honey. Getting a rash. Oh, cancer again. Good grief. Jeez Louise. People are conspiring to kill me. But why? I'm like the nicest person in the world. Everyone loves me. Don't they? Eh. No rash anymore. Great. Fantastic. Let's approve the scheme. And you are now in, pri in my prison. Great. Force your demands. And then we will sacrifice you to Satan. There we go. He was not a virgin. It's a bit of a shame. Oh well. More people. More people willing to um, sacrifice their souls to Satan. Great. I'm actually okay with it. And just like that, we have fulfilled our ambition. That was quick. Oh yes, we can upgrade our Kasbah towns. Perfect. Let's upgrade the ones that aren't quite as developed first. Because I'm also not that rich right now. Vala did prospers. Great. Um, unfortunately, there appears to be some kind of disease. Consumption? My whole family's probably gonna die. Yep, there we go. Bye bye, wife. It's been uh, nice knowing you, I guess. Yes! She's come out of hiding. Perfect. This is the time to strike. Kill her. No, I will not give you more land. Give you land that you don't deserve, you asshole. Actually, was I planning on doing something? I was actually planning on taking over this thing, wasn't I? Yeah, yeah, let's do that. Let's do a dessert. Whoa, oh my god. Another. <sighs> that sucks. That really sucks. That is so frustrating. Ah, <sighs> alright. Fine. We will... Deal with that. As we may. Great. More courtiers named Ibn. Guys, I'm just trying to take my de jure land here. This belongs to me. You guys are jerks. Freaking hell. Oh shit. Oh my god, now no! Slip of the finger, shit. Ah, you know what though? It's fine. We can deal with this. We've dealt with this in the past, in, like the former crusades and shit. It's fine, you know what? This will give us a chance to really trim the fat of the uh, Christian rulers around us. So, it's all good. What is this? What aren't you doing? Chancellor, come back and do your statecraft, you asshole. What a jerk. What an unbelievable jerk. Actually, why don't you guys... Thank you for, um... You know, being outside of a border of the, uh, like, allotted thing there. Message. But... Yeah, let's... Whoa! France is really fighting them off. <laughs> that's really funny. Who the hell are you? Sure, be Visigothic. I don't really give a rat's ass, one way or another. Perfect. And yeah, we're gonna trim the fat of the uh, Christian neighbors around us. And we are no longer paranoid. Great. We will... try to win this war as quickly as possible... by... sieging down their main territories, I think. I think that should hopefully um, get us to win this war fairly quickly, I'm guessing. It's gonna be take two days, that's fine. Perfect. 25%. We should be able to win this very soon. The werewolf. You've been nervous for the last couple of nights, sleeping restlessly, feeling a strange pull on your mind. During the days, you have been tired, but also sensed with anticipation, sensing something important arriving. Now, at night, as you wake and see the full moon rise, you finally understand. It's the moon. It speaks to you. It is time to rise. Time to become the wolf. Time to go out. Time to be free. Time to lose your mind to the moon madness. 
And I'm not gonna do it. We are a werewolf! Holy shit! Wow. <laughs> I've never had this happen before either. You run through the night until you reach the highest hill in the site. You spend hours and hours howling at the moon, exulting in her light and in your madness. Holy crap. You wake in the morning, but you feel as though you hadn't slept at all. Your muscles ache and your throat is sore. As you try to speak, you realize that you're quite hoarse. How could that be? You don't remember anything. You don't even remember that you should get rid of your fucking spaces after the apostrophe, apostrophe before the T. Of course not. Oh shit, we just took a huge stack, um, attrition penalty. Fuck, we lost like... 10,000 troops. My god, that was terrible. Absolutely just terrible. Chest pains. That's probably from all the, uh, werewolf running. Maybe, I don't know. Shit! We're taking... Oh, massive attrition penalties here. Crap! Oh, shit. We have consumption. That's fine. You know what? Not only are we immortal, but we can get Satan's help to, um, fix that issue. Stop your stupid ass shit. And we're chasing down gophers. You know what? That's natural behavior for a, for a werewolf anyways, right? And that should just be the last one. 99%. Why is it only 99%? Because we haven't won a major battle. Are you kidding me right now? I think we haven't won a major battle? Wreck your anus with a major battle. Now see if we can fight them and then maybe get a major battle. Is that, does that count as a major battle? I have no idea. I'm hoping? Yeah, we're just getting back some of our troops, which is great. But I think we might need to attack these guys. I don't... Oh, actually, we need to attack their actual main force, right? I think that's how it works. Absolutely not good, sir. You're gonna stay there and take the sword, shove it up your butt. 99% still, why? We won several battles, what are you talking about, man? Don't lie to me. What do you want me to do? You want me to satanically possess someone? Sure, I'll do it. Do you want any- have anyone in mind, or just anyone? Hoping it's not just anyone. Think this guy will make a good Chief Cuddy? No, he will not. Because we had a Chief Cuddy, I don't know what happened to him. What do these Chief Cuddies keep dying? What assholes? What unbelievable assholes? I don't know why they decided to reinforce this dying stack with like 2,000 troops. Seriously, why am I not getting this last percent? Has not yet won a major battle. What exactly do you count as a major battle? I just wiped the floor with 8,000 troops. What the fuck is your problem? What exactly do you count as a major battle then? I'm not getting this. I am seriously not understanding this. You're in hiding? What a piece of shit. What an unbelievable dickwad. Oh my god. Okay, stop bothering me with useless crap, please! An epidemic. What? We have received news of a horrible epidemic in Diadora, part of the ecumenical Petri- Oh my god, what happened to the Byzantine Empire? You are not a... You're a feudal ruler. What? I don't know. At first, the rumors were thought to be exaggerated, but ever since the disorderly arrival of inconsolable refugees at our gates, it has been difficult to ignore what is happening. They tell of various symptoms, and our courtiers from the area report seeing large buboes, people, people vomiting blood before dying, while others have extreme extremities turned black, rotting off their bodies. Terror is spreading as rapidly as the disease, and so far there has been no mention of a cure, only mass graves. Is this the will of Shaitan? Measles! Measles! Oh, the Black Plague. It's back. But, you know what? It's probably not going to spread at the same rate that it did before. So I'm okay with it. Yeah, this is frustrating as all hell. I accidentally attacked it. It wasn't even my intention to attack him. Oh, I need a new court physician. Good grief! There's way too much going on right now. I have two extra county or things? Oh, it's because these guys died. 
Need to get a new core physician. That guy's no good. Well, not as good anyways. Why can't I do this? Once every three years. Oh, I already sent out the uh, missive, right? I think? Could be wrong. Please. One of your scouts report of a pilgrim who just arrived in Burgos. The pilgrim, known as Theodore Dorito, has been on a pious quest to visit all the Yazidi holy sites and is now ending his journey here. During his travels, he has accumulated a vast knowledge regarding medicine and is seeking to put his skills to use. Recruit this pilgrim. And let's seek treatment for my illness. Pilgrim, don't get sick. I... Uh, well te tested, please. I don't want your mystical crap. Successful. Perfect. Seriously, what major battle are you looking for? Holy crap, I've won so many fucking battles. Like, what is this garbage? You know what it is? It is garbage. That's what it is. That's exactly what it is. Ah, oh, jeez. Who exactly do I have to fight to win this crap? What the shit is this? Oh, people are dying because of um various diseases. Yeah, yeah, you know what? That's fine. I understand now. Come on, I really want to win this before we end the episode. This is getting frustrating as all hell. Alright, let's wipe the floor with them. Great, and we'll take this back. Thank you very much for keeping it safe for us. Did they just attack us? With like 10 troops? Was it like freaking Christian like kamikaze squad? Great, we lost consumption. Fantastic. What is happening with these guys? Oh my god. A huge stack just joined in. Shit. I think we're winning this though. Holy crap. Our forces are incredible. My god, they just keep reinforcing like nobody's business. I mean, it's their business, I guess. Oh my god. Wow. If this isn't... This isn't a major battle. Please. Please don't tell me this is not a major battle. Good, that was a major battle. Okay, so we just need to siege this down. What the fuck, CK2? What the fuck? How was that not a major fucking battle? With our 10,000, we basically just killed off like... I don't know, almost twice? I'm guessing-ish? The number of troops that attacked us? And that's not a major battle. No. No, oh no. What the hell is happening? I'm so confused as to what is happening right now. I'm legit lost. Oh, jeez. Well, at least that's over. Um, thankfully, now we can, I think, form the Duchy of Savoy. You will actually just straight up usurp it from this jerk. Son of a bitch. My god, that was frustrating. I don't, I don't know. I don't know what was happening there. If someone could explain that to me, that would be fantastic. That would be really grateful. Because I thought that we had won several major battles, even before leading up to that really epic one. Where we got attacked by like... You know, well, I attacked and then we got attacked by the reinforcements and all that shit. So yeah, I don't really understand what happened there. If someone could explain that to me, I'd be very grateful. Um, again, I hate to sound like a broken record. But yeah, let me know what you guys know about that situation? Eh, whatever. It's, I guess it's not that big of a deal since we've already won it. And we will give the Duchy of Savoy to you. Great. That's exactly what we've been fighting for this whole time. This took like a million years to do it. Perfect. And if you could work on statecraft, thank you very much. And uh, it seems like smallpox consumption and all that is starting to recede, which is good. Unfortunately, Black Death has come into Toulouse. But hopefully it shouldn't um, progress any farther than that. Yeah. Let's leave it off here and uh, we'll come back again in the next episode for some more of this weird shit that is happening.
which may or may not be my fault. I don't know. And uh, I didn't need to actually attack them with the uh, um, with a threat and all that. But you know what? Seeing as how we were actually able to fend them off fairly easily, I think we don't really need to be worried about threat that much anymore. I think we can just basically take whatever the hell we want and then, you know, the rest of the world be damned. But yeah, we'll do that in the next episode. So for now, thanks for watching and have a good breakfast.